Hi, this is Hao Qingyuan. This is my game display video. In this video, I'll show you my VR project for Game Design Studio today, named Is Castle. My game is based on the story of Bluebeard. Now, let's start. This is my game AP key I installed earlier. This game based on Oculus Quest 2. The way to install my APK to the headset is in my report. The game screen is projected from the headset to the official casting website. The picture of me is recorded by Zoom. I use Adobe PR to put them together. This is a main menu. You can choose to start or exit the game. You can select three levels difficulty of the game. The difference in game difficulty lies in the difference in game time and the difference in the deduction of health from falling from a height. Besides those, all three levels have same tasks and the same way to play, find scores and stories. In this video, I will go through easy level to show the game me mechanics and flow. This is a game UI that can follow the player. It contains information such as time, items, and health. And you can see your virtual hands for grabbing game items. First of all, we need to pick up the torch so that they can move around in the dark maze. And I'm really sorry, the video is projected from my headset through Wi-Fi, so bad connection happens. This is the first storyboard, you can pick up and use your torch to collect it. Now let's check on the UI interface, you can see the first storyboard has been successfully collected. Now there are 6 scores and 5 storyboards left. Same way to collect the second storyboard. You can adjust the position of the torch in hand. Grab and touch it with your torch. Now 4 storyboards left. Now let's try to explore the maze to see if we can find a score. Here we find a score of one of Bluebeard's old wives, same way to save the soul. Pick up the score and purify with the flame in your torch to liberate her soul. Pips. You can add some strange actions like me to make it look more mysterious and solemn. Now 5 scores and 4 storyboards left, but now it's time to solve the maze. The first maze is successfully solved. You can find 2 storyboards and 1 score in the first maze. Now let's explore the second maze. You will find another score and 4 storyboards here. And I'm really sorry for the bad connection. Really sorry. It is easy to find the first storyboard. Collect it like we did before. You can see 3 storyboards and 5 scores left. Now explore the second maze which is bigger than the first one. Don't forget to collect items. This is the fourth storyboard. If you couldn't read the story very well, don't worry, you will see the whole story after collecting all 6 storyboards. This is the 5th storyboard, be careful about the time. Now let's find the last one and try if we could find a score. This is another score. You can grab the score to see the modeling details, but remember to click it. Just one more storyboard and then we can go to the next scene which is Bluebeard's castle. This is a little tips for the player in order to increase the player's sense of tension and immersion. Finally, this is the last one. Now we can know the secret and the story about Bluebeard.
After the storyboard collection is complete, Bluebeard's story will pop up for players to read. At the same time, the second scene is unlocked for the player, which means the next step is to escape from Bluebeard's castle. Important hint. When the next scene is unlocked, you can never go back to this maze. So you need to make sure you have collected every score in the maze, or you can only wait for lose. You need to collect all six scores to open the castle gate to escape. After clicking Fine, player will be automatically sent to castle. In fact, the last storyboard is on the exit of the maze. This is Bluebeard's castle, the second scene. At first, grab the torch to explore the castle, and you need the torch to collect the scores. Look, we find the first score in the second scene, which is the third one in the whole game. Grab and burn it. Well done, you save another soul. Now I will show you the exit. We will see what will happen if you try to leave without collecting all scores. And that is the exit. On the way to exit, collect another score by the way. You may need to squat to collect this one. Now let's try to escape. You can see the door closed tightly, so don't waste time find the remaining scores. And don't forget your torch. You need your torch to collect scores. Now we can see the fifth score of the game. We are really close to win. The last one is here. Same way to click it, and now we can check the condition of the exit again. Let's go to the exit, escape from the scary castle. You can see the originally locked door has opened. Now let's say goodbye to this castle, or you can challenge another level later. Now let's stick the torch in the wall. You saved six unjust dead souls, so you deserve this win. You can go through this exit to finish this. You did it and you can replay this game